Okay, friends, I'm going to be starting with the stove. Since I feel like that's the easiest part of the kitchen, I will be linking my Valentine's haul in the description. I do show you guys exactly where I got everything I'm going to be using in this video. For the back of my stove, I actually wanted to hang a frame, but I couldn't find anything that was not farmhouse related. So I just decided to buy these glittery hearts from the Dollar Tree and just put a double sided tape on the back. And I actually love how it turned out. Now for this corner, I am going to be using this cake holder that I got from the 99 cents and I am also going to be using this cup and the little balls that I got from Dollar Tree last year. They do still have them. I did see them a few days ago. For this part, I'm going to be using a heart steak that I got from at home. But you guys can use other things like spatulas, some candy, maybe even some flowers. To finish off our tray, I'm going to be adding this tiny mug that I got from Hobby Lobby. I'm just simply going to be removing the little sticks and just placing them inside our mug. And that way we have a cute little mug full of little hearts. For the island, I'm going to be placing these hearts that I got from the Dollar Tree together to form a table runner. I'm just going to be adding a tiny drop of hot glue to keep them together. I am going to be making a rose bouquet with items that I already have here at the house. The pebbles, I got them from the Dollar Tree. Roses, I got them last year from... Hobby Lobby
I did have one heart left, so I decided to place it here since I did not really have anywhere else to place it. And I'm going to be using this sign that I got from the 99 cents. This has to be one of my favorite items that I got this year. And this beautiful base that I got from the Dollar Tree. I'm just going to be adding one single row since it doesn't really have enough space for me to add more flowers and this little heart sign that I got from Berlin. 